When you look at the Komogawa gym, there's a lot of characters that have come and gone, but one that sticks to mind is the legendary Geromich. <laughs> The first kohai that Ippo had, you can say also the first experience he had as being a coach was Geromichi, like especially when he was recovering from Sendo fight when Geromichi joined the gym. Like to talk about Geromichi, you have to look at his backstory because of how similar he is to Ippo himself. So Ippo naturally felt close to this kid because the kid resembled him to some degree. Like he was a kid that was also bullied. He had latent potential, but he wasn't showing it. Like, so Ippo felt the need to take him under the wing. And at that point, he was also recovering after the Sendo fight. So his fist was broken. So he couldn't really do much. Now he could train this kid with the basics, the jabs, the running, all the aspects that were not so much the physical or fighting aspect of boxing, training, conditioning, all those things. This is the perfect time to take a break. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Enjoy. The story of how he got his name is Gero Michi. It's also hilarious. It's Ippo at his finest. The comedy was amazing. It was when Ippo and Takamura were making their names out there and like a lot of people wanted to join the Komogawa gym. And they held this event for people to come and test their resolve essentially. So Takamura decided to take them out on a run and Takamura being Takamura not holding back anything. He went full sprint. People were dying. Ippo was chasing them from the behind and then he saw a whole bunch of people like on the floor that he encountered this kid that seemed kind of odd so he went and approached him and Geromichi vomited on him but that was not where he got the name Geromichi at the end, like almost everybody gave out from the race, like apart from the Kamogawa regulars, but there was one kid that pulled through, Geromichi. He pulled in and the moment he got there, everybody saw him and then he vomited again. So right there and then Takamura gave him the name of Geromichi. Geromichi? <laughs> After he joined, there was a lot of things that he was lacking in. And they had this moment after he followed Ippo to the boxing match, the sparring match with Ejidate. And after that match, he had felt this need to tell Ippo like his feelings because Ippo was his idol essentially. And he wanted to tell Ippo like how he was feeling and how everything was for him up till that time. He was this kid that was bullied consistently by other kids in schools. He has moved around a bit so like he couldn't find friends, make friends. And he told Ippo this thing. Ippo told him this story, which was basically Ippo's story, but it wasn't him, if that makes sense. And he told him how before he used to be that kid, the one that's always bullied, the one that was the butt of all the jokes, the one, he, he was that kid, like before Takamura saved him, and then Geromichi like realized, yeah, that's true. Like Ippo can do this. I can also fix up my thing. Like Ippo can be the face of the bullied, I guess. Boxing. <laughs> And for me, that was a really emotional moment. But at the end, the time came for Geromichi to leave the gym, and now he left. So we thought that was the end of Geromichi. Only for us later on to find out after Ippo became champion, Gero Michi made it, making a comeback. Apparently, he went on to become a professional boxer, and now he is known as Hammer now. Like, he looks different. He is shaved, bald, like, no eyebrows. Like, he was serious, serious. So, they met at the press conference, or rather, the way in. Ippo tried to shake him. He did not give any respect to his senpai. 
So they went into the ring and Ippo put the fear of God into his soul. And after that, many thought Garamichi would be done, but it seems like he has retired. But for the most part, he is still training and doing the regular things because we saw this clip in one of Takamura's escapades and he ran into the village, but he didn't see Naomichi and Garamichi now was helping out the people in the city. He was seen as a respectable member of society. And for me, that was a really nice conclusion to his character arc. And I can't wait to see, maybe we see more of him. I don't think we're going to see more of him, but I hope we see him again in the manga or something. Just not even as a fighter, but like as a friend, I guess. Like, can't wait to see where Ippo goes with this. And the way the manga is going, I feel like we're almost there. Like, Ippo has to make a comeback soon. But anyway, no manga spoilers in this one. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Let us know what you like down below. Let us know if you're a Gero Mitchell fan or you hate him. Let us know down below. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Bums out.